it's so nice. <laughs> my e-liquid is so good. It's from Yummy Vapor. Yummy. It's uh, three milligram nicotine, and it's I think it's called Yummy. Yummy. Yummy probably. Um, it's custard. I got the hundred mil for only twenty four dollars. I could not pass that up. If you go to Alien Vapor and you get 130 milliliters of um, e-juice, it's like 40 something, I believe. So that's why I'm glad I got that one for 100 and I paid 24 for it. So I'm happy. I got the mag from Smock and it's amazing. I like that it feels really good in my hand. I have tiny hands. I'm only four foot nine and I'm small everywhere except for up here. And down here <laughs> so and I have a little bit of a belly on me but that's okay but I'm so short and tiny statured that it's really cool to find a mod that fits in my hands like it does like I can wrap my fingers all the way around to the screen which is really good for me some people might not like a mod that small they may feel like they can't see their screen if they cover it up that could be a con for you guys I do love this it feels like it's made out of resin the drip tip feels like it's made out of resin like a epoxy like it, it does it feels like that plasticky kind of epoxy feeling stuff and it's got these little details on them I don't think you guys can fully see that I'm trying to get you guys to see it in the light um, but I love this thing I've been chain vaping it like crazy and I still haven't even used half my battery I'm addicted to this thing because it's so good I do let it rest in between a little bit so that the coils don't get too hot and the flavor goes away because when you get this as, as the coils are cooled all the way down and you take a hit off of it, it is so good. The flavor off that vape um, juice, e-liquid, e-juice, there's a lot of new terms for this stuff. I've even heard of juuling as being a name for things, but me... I love this. I actually rate this about as good as an Enjoy King, in my opinion. And that's a hard sell for me because if something, because the Enjoy King, I loved those so much for va vapor production and portability and all that stuff. This is about as good as an Enjoy King. Actually, I say it's better than an Enjoy King because it's more technology and all that kind of stuff. You've got a better screen layout, you've got a puff counter, you've got. You can even set this for how many um, puffs you want it to be. I want to clear my uh, puff counter. I don't know how yet. I've got to look that up. This product is so new. There's not a lot of information out about it yet. And so I'm going to read the manual again and see if I can clear my puff counter. Because right now, I've only had it two days and I've puffed 139 puffs already. And I'm about to do another one. So it'll be about 140 to 145 by the time the day is over with because I'm like I love this e-liquid I love this tank I'm using the q4 tank I don't put my v12 in here yet because I'm going to but right now I'm gonna wait until the lifespan of this atomizer goes out because they have a lifespan of, and how much I'm vaping on it it's probably not gonna last as long because I love to vape I love the flavor it gives me excuse me I also end up with what I like to call vape burps i burp <laughs> and and i know it's from the e-liquid because gum does the same thing for me anything with flavor it makes me burp or i'll get hiccups gum does that uh e-liquid does that it's just one of those weird things that happens to me that it doesn't happen to everybody and I love this custard flavor because I don't eat a lot of sweets. I don't like to eat a lot of sweets, but for some reason, vaping the sweets, it, it makes me feel a lot better. Um, I can get the taste of sweets. And it also helps me because I, I deal with an eating issue. I do have an eating problem, meaning I don't like to eat a lot of food. And I don't, but yet I, I, I think about food all the time. And I'm constantly craving new things and weird things. And this helps me so I don't overeat because I, I don't like to eat a lot of food, but I constantly worry about food. Like, I'm constantly thinking about food. And um, to vape, the flavor gives me the feeling like I've had that flavor in my mouth and I don't go running to the kitchen to get some weird food. Now, right now I'm hungry and I'm probably going to have to eat because I ate this morning, but I haven't ate all day. So, 
and it's been a couple of hours. It's been a good couple hours since I've ate. Um, and I'm craving fish balls, so I might steam those, which is easy to do. I have a tin for my, um, my cake tin, the kind you break away. You know, you clip the thing off, and it releases the bottom. So I can do that, and I'll just poke holes in some tin foil and layer it a couple times and layer it in there, and I can make a steamer basket with the, the, the thing. It's not going to be that hard, but I really want to make some fish balls. It's literally just tilapia that I'm going to use and egg whites mixed in with a little bit of salt and maybe some um, like green uh, onions and mix it in there, the dried green onions, mix it in and then put it with the tilapia after I've squished it to death into like a paste and then um, steam them for like 10-15 minutes just until they're done all the way and they look white on the outside and they look pretty I'll probably do that I haven't made a video in so long that's why I'm posting one now because I really do care about you guys and I didn't forget I've just been 